Patrick, this rec center will be the only polling location in the entire city. Simply put, they don't have enough poll workers. Today, the governor told 12 News unless a judge intervenes, the election next week is on. It still looks a bit surreal, doesn't it? Election workers in protective masks. Our pants are sanitized after every use, so uh, you can use our pants. Early voters not leaving their cars and an election eight days away. While you're telling everyone to stay home every, every single day, are you comfortable telling people in a week and one day to go to the polls? Well, I mean, people are people are going to the grocery store in a week and a day, too. So it's not as if, yes, we want people to stay at home, but uh, democracy has to move forward. And and we have a date. We have a date. It's enshrined in state law. The city of Milwaukee says it's short a thousand poll workers and like others now forced to likely consolidate polling sites. We have a national, a state and a local declaration of emergency and there's still people who want to push people toward the polls. How in the world do we keep people safe if they're coming to the polls? It's an extreme burden on everybody. I get that. But at the end of the day, at, you know, using today as an example, we will have an election on April 7th. Well, Matt, the governor is asking people to request absentee ballots, but there's not much time left. No time is running out already. More than 883,000 people have requested ballots. The deadline to register online is tonight at 11.59 p.m. The deadline to request absentee ballots is Thursday. Election officials, though, are urging everyone to request them now.